I am Adil Kumar. We will learn the techniques of substitution to find derivative of inverse trigonometric functions. So here is an example. We need to differentiate y equals to cos inverse 2x square minus 1. So let us review a few trigonometric identities which we have learned. Uh, for example, the most important formula is cos of 2x. Now it could be written in different ways. We can write this as 2 cos square x minus 1. We could write this as 1 minus 2 sine square x. And we can also write this as cos square x minus sine square x, right? So these are different ways in which this formula can be written. Now here you realize that our strategy is to get cos function inside this bracket. Then cos inverse of cos will just give us the angle and we'll be able to differentiate it easily. Now, the formula right here helps us to visualize the substitution which should be done to solve this question, correct? So, what we will do here is we'll substitute x as cos x, right? So, if I substitute, so let, let x be equals to cos x, in that case, we could write inside term as cos 2x, correct? So, that is to say, uh, I mean theta, right? So, in that case, theta will be equals to cos inverse x, right? So, we'll make this substitution and rewrite the question. So, now the question is y equals to cos inverse of 2 times, instead of x, I'm writing cos theta. So, it gives 2 cos square theta minus 1. Now, cos inverse of 2 cos square theta minus 1 is cos 2 theta, right? So, we could write this as cos 2 theta. Cos inverse of cos 2 theta is 2 theta. And we know theta is cos inverse of x. So, we could rewrite this as a function of x, which is cos inverse of x. So, we have y equals to 2 cos inverse x. Now, we can differentiate very easily. We have dy dx equals to d dx of 2 cos inverse x. 2 is a constant, so we get 2. And the derivative of cos inverse x is minus 1 over square root of 1 minus x square, right? So we get our result as minus 2 over square root of 1 minus x square. So that is how we can differentiate using this kind of substitution. Now in coming videos, we are going to do similar substitution. So if you keep a track of these and how we are working, it will be very easy for you to get uh, these questions done correctly and easily. I'm Anil Kumar. You can always share and subscribe my videos. Thank you and all the best.